You have no business. Isn't there a decency law that applies to just such things? Buongiorno. Salute, Ser Ezio. Shall we take a look at the list? Buon viaggio!
It's time. You did it. It's beautiful. See. Si. Now let's hope your idea works. Because we're nearly out of time. Listen close, Ezio. You're going to want to fly from fire to fire. The heat of each one you pass over should lift you back up in the air again. Bene. Careful, though. There's archers out on the roofs tonight. Avoid those arrows, or it will be a short trip. I wish there was some way I could use my sword while flying these things. <laughs> well, you do have your feet free. If you get close enough without taking an arrow in the head, maybe you could kick them off the building. Nice. It's now or never, amico mio.
was that? Don't worry. Probably just kids with firecrackers. Come, it's your move. Listen to me when you have the chance. Seems you have failed, assassin. Forgive me, signore. I tried. Why? What was it all for? <laughs> Assassino! Assassino! He's killed the Doge! The Doge is dead! One assassin to kill another, it seems. We kill thinking it's best for us. Do we not, Messer Ezio? I do this not for myself. Compio questo sacrificio per il bene superiore. Requiescat in pace. You... You killed me? You killed me?! You're alive! I is it true? They say you killed the Doge. I was trying to save him, Leonardo. But the truth matters little. I failed. And now I'm the most wanted man in Venezia. Well, perhaps you are in luck. It's Carnevale in Venezia. This is the time when everybody goes without a face. That's why I'm here. Do you have a mask I can wear? Of course, of course. Somewhere in here. Grazie, amico mio. And I have something for you. Oh, more of the Codex. Aha, this one's quite complex. Hmm, it's a new design, my friend. A mechanism for your wrist, but not a blade. In fact, it seems to be a kind of arma da fuoco, but as small as a hummingbird. Is that possible? I have no idea. Let's build it and find out.
Det är värt av. Han blir värd. You done me good, brother. Ma certo. But I'm sure your return was not just to play with new toys. Is it about this terrible new dodge they've installed? Marco Barbarico. Then you'll want to speak with your friend Antonio. I've seen him quite a bit lately at a, a mutual friend's. I'd look for him there, in the Dorsoduro district, to the south. Ask for Sister Teodora. Sister? Well, um, <clears throat> in a way, yes. Sister, and Ezio, you can't be carrying weapons out there today. Grazie, Leonardo. Now, about that mask. Another time, then. No, that until word returns to us. Come, friends. Perhaps another time. You will not get me a deal back. This method is a question. Antonio, we need to talk. Ezio! Ezio Auditore! Teodora, meet the most uh, <coughs> talented man in all of Venezia. Madonna. Ah, Sister Teodora. I never imagined you as a religious type. <laughs> it depends how you understand religion, my son. It's not just men's souls that call for soothing. Come! Join us, Ezio. Have a drink. Meet the ladies. Ah! Murderer! Butcher! He sliced Lucia and stole so, her money! So, Messer Ezio, let's see just how talented you are. After him! Don't come any closer. Or I will carve up another one. Run! Fear! Madness! Who the hell are you? Get away from me! Stay back, or I will kill them! I swear it! Have her gratitude, Ezio. Why is it wherever you go, trouble falls? Antonio, I trust you know why I'm here. I imagine to read Venice of Marco Barbarico. But really, Ezio, we did this once already. And this new Templar Doge is a bigger culo than the last. 
Never mind that he never leaves the palazzo. Yes, except for tonight. Marco wouldn't dare miss Carnevale. How do you know this? In fact, he's throwing the biggest party of them all. But getting in won't be so simple. You'll need a golden mask for entry. And before you think about forging one, keep in mind, each mask is numbered. Fortunately for you, I have an idea. Let's see if we can't win you a mask. What is it, my son? You want to ask me something? I do. Forgive me, but why is it you wear a nun's habit if you aren't one? <laughs> well, whoever said I wasn't. Indeed, I am married to the Lord. And yet you are also a courtesan. You run a bordello. So? I see no contradiction. How I choose to practice my faith. What I choose to do with my body. These are my choices to make. Like many young women, I was drawn to the church, but grew disillusioned by the believers of the city. Men hold God only as an idea in their heads, not in the depths of their hearts and bodies. Men must know how to love in order to reach salvation. My girls and I provide that to our congregation. No church would agree with me, I realized, so I created my own. It may not be traditional, but men's hearts grow firmer than I care. Among other things, I'm sure. Signore, signore! Come on, come all! The games of Carnevale are about to begin. Do you have the coraggio to compete for as grand a prize as this? This year, like every year, the Golden Mask will provide entry for one, a uno solo, to our most beloved Doge's personal ball. Who would not desire such an exceptional reward? Come, compete! Whoever proves themselves champion in each of four games today shall be the Doge's personal guest tonight. You'd best get to it, Ezio. <laughs> 